When they punch, they punch so hard, they make this bubble that collapses in on itself yeah, with yeah. immense force and creates a secondary shockwave that can stun or kill prey, even mm. if they miss oh, with their punch. Oh, really? So you okay. get punched, you get like yeah. blown into pieces. Yeah. And then if you don't get punched, you're you like, get the hey, swerved. Beautiful. You get the aftershock. <laughs> These bubbles, when they collapse, they emit a flash of light and heat up to 4,400 degrees Celsius. Really? Okay. <laughs> which is almost as hot as the yeah. surface. <laughs> the sun. We've got fusion. Yeah, right. So these researchers were like, how the hell do they not get hurt? Hmm. They're throwing these punches. But if you throw a punch like that, how do you not get hurt by the recoil? The researchers wondered that the sh whether the shrimp's clubs utilised like material structures beyond just being tough and crack resistant. And then they sort of just like tried to see how stress waves travelled through the club. Hmm. What they found is that the mantis shrimp's club consists of two different regions. So the impact region. And this has a herringbone pattern structure of mineralised fibres that reinforce the club against the fractures. And then we go into the periodic region, which is made up of a bouligand, hmm. which is a corkscrew-like corkscrew structure hmm. that selectively filters out the harmful high frequency stress waves and prevents the damaging vibrations from traveling back into the shrimp's arm and into their soft tissues and allow it to strike repeatedly without hmm. injury bam 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 bam